Hi, my name is Shmuel Metz from Columbus, Ohio, and I want to share with the Chabur members and those watching a beautiful idea on this week's Parsha. So this week's Parsha with Parsha Kitavo has an incredible conversation about Bikurim, the first fruits, and what a person does when they get to the Beit HaMikdash to give their first fruits. And they say a chapter of Arami Oved Avi. And this chapter is also said in the Seder night. So what does the Seder night have to do with the Bikurim process? So clearly there's, there's a common denominator, and that's the idea of newness and freshness, and he's Chadshut. So why? Because Pesach is an incredible time of Rosh Chodesh Chadash and Nisan, and the blossoming of the trees and the chirpings of the birds and the beautiful weather. And this is definitely a time of newness. Bikurim, the first fruits, this is also a beautiful time of newness, and he's Chadshut as well. So it's interesting, very fascinating that in these two beautiful and new things that a person experiences in their life, the first thing a person does in both of them is talk about the past. In regards to the Bikurim, a person gets there and they talk about the past. Of Arami Oviravi. And and also the Seder night. We talk about stories from the past and what happened when we left Egypt. And in a time of newness, we discuss our history. Why? Why? Why do we discuss the history when we're living in the moment? So beautiful, beautiful idea suggested by Rabbi Savalovsky, I think can shed light on the answer. And I think that when a person goes into new ventures, new situations, they can't see that their, their new situation is independent from the, the history that it had. In terms of ventures and learning, a person starts something new and learning, so they have to realize the long chain of beautiful Masora that we all came from, the long chain all standing all the way back to Harsinai and before. And when a person goes through any new venture in life, it's the same thing. That we have to recognize the history and the beauty and the incredible richness that the, the venture carries with it and the history of it as well. And with this idea, when we go through new ventures and go to have new situations, it's a time of newness this year as well, starting the starting jobs and starting school wherever people are. So recognize that there is a history, beautiful history behind each and every one of those of those new things that a person does. Have a good job.